What's up, everybody? Welcome back to the PokeCuz TCG channel. For today's video, we are continuing the theme from this past Saturday's video with more mystery packs. But more specifically, we have the Unlisted Leaf Mystery Booster Packs all the way from Australia here. We've got three of these today. We're going to crack into these. We'll get more details out here in just a second. We're going to see if we can pull another gold pack. Here we go, y'all. Start this music! Let's do this again, y'all. Have some fun with Unlisted Leaf Mystery Packs here today. Quick reminder, we are giving away this gold medal Pikachu from the Celebrations Ultra Premium Collection Box as part of the October Slab Giveaway. You must go check out this past Saturday's humongous Mystery Box opening video. It will be linked in the cards after this video as well and how you can enter to win this. Happy Monday, everybody. Hope you all had a fantastic weekend for today. We have got, took a few weeks for them to get here. The Unlisted Leaf version 2.0 Mystery Booster Pack. So if you're familiar with the PokeRef packs, Unlisted Leaf is a YouTuber as well that released his own Ando, released his own Mystery Booster Packs here. Same exact premise here. These were $50 USD, and uh, we got basically essentially the same exact odds as a PokeRef pack. Five booster packs, one exclusive video, one Mystery Booster in here as well. And you're here, are, here are the chances of that mystery booster, y'all. So, five Skull and Violet Sword and Shield Era mystery booster. Gold. One in 25 is what we're going for. We pulled a gold pack over the weekend out of the Pokeref pack. Watsy or Heart Gold Soul Silver. Silver, Black and White or X and Y. One in 10. Red, Sun and Moon Era. One in five. Or Green Packs. Sword and Shield. Minimum guarantee in here. How are we going to do this, y'all? Let me know your thoughts on these down below in the comments. Have you picked up some? Do you know who Unlisted Leaf is? Do you watch Unlisted Leaf's videos? Let me know what you think of these mystery packs down below. Are they worth the 50 bucks? Genuinely curious on how you all feel about every mystery pack that we open up here on the channel. Here we go. Our five packs. Nothing in the bottom. Nothing here. So just so you all can see, I'm not hiding anything. Mystery booster pack. Here is, if you guys want to scan that in. Exclusive Unlisted Leaf video. I hope, Ando, you don't mind. Here we go. Lost Origin. I'm sure you all already saw the green back here. Uh, we do... Oh, boy. Okay. Um, Crown and Losty. Three Scarlet and Violet packs. Oh, boy. Okay. So, we're going to go Obsidian Flames, Paldea Evolved, and then Scarlet and Violet Base. Uh, I This early Scarlet and Violet era, not a fan of. You can find these packs just about anywhere for $3 a pack. Uh, Scarlet and Violet Base... Not, should not be it's it's like uh it's like darkness of blaze it just should not be in mystery packs anymore we got we got to figure out a way i know everyone has to make their money right i understand but we gotta do a way to get rid of these one and two dollar packs battle styles for instance that just nobody really wants to open go goat and paul mod it's um i'm just not a fan how they evolved i'm okay with how they evolved a lot of cool art rares in here we still need that magic harp so let's see if we can pull the magic harp out of how they evolved but for 50 bucks when you have three Scarlet and Violet packs that are 10 bucks of, like total between the three of them, we gotta we got figure out a way to uh, to get something different in there, right? Jump off, Brigham Backs, Copper Jaw there on the EX card. All right, Obsidian Flames, Charizard pack, our, our set is complete, but you know I would not argue with another Charizard card. Any, any of them, honestly, would look really nice sitting back there. Lightning Energy to the back we go here. Chandelure, Pupitar, and Darkrai. Okay, so not a lot of packs in today's video, but... We're checking out to see again mystery packs. There's been a, a theme of the past few days. I promise this this is about the extent of the mystery packs here for this week. But we're seeing if are these worth it. Granted, everybody knows that mystery packs are a gamble, right? Everyone knows that. That's that's a given. So these are a gamble. You're always going to be gambling for a chance at the higher rarity pack, and and that's the thing with any mystery pack. So keep that in mind as you as you think about mystery packs it may not be worth 50 bucks but you're gambling for a chance on a three or four dollar pack so the, the odds are are as they are because that reason because of that reason so something back here right radiant charge of bug and a heliolisk nice radiant card here we do have a green pack so it does say minimum guarantee sword and shield era so they're i'm hoping there's not a scarlet and violet pack in here that's uh that's my main hope based on what the uh, what the package itself says so Crown Zenith. Okay. So two Crown Zenith, a Lost Origins. So that's uh, 14 50 bucks there, plus the 10 bucks for the Scarlet and Violet packs. We got about half our money back. 25 bucks in value for a $50 pack here, but we got a few more chances out of here. This is a warm-up pack. Just a warm-up pack. 
B. And a Rayquaza V Max. Very nice. We still need this card in Evolving Skies. Uh, Rayquaza V. Rainbow. You know what I'm talking about? Evolving Skies. Let's see if we have an Evolving Skies pack in here. I know. I, I'm all right. I promise. It's a, it's Monday. All right. Here we go. Oh. Okay. Okay. We got red for our second mystery pack here. So we're going up the ladder, which, uh, which I'm a fan of. Nothing else there in the pack. We got a red pack. Okay. I'm cool with that. But... The packs themselves, same exact code that's in here as well. And this one, they're not different. And they're the same exact pack. Interesting. Okay. Crown Lost, Obsidian, Paldea, Scott of Ops, same packs. Interest. Um, I would have, uh, I would have liked to have seen some, uh, some different packs in, in each one. Maybe the third one will be different. If the third one's the exact same. Then, uh, then we'll comment. But same sets in two of them thus far. Okay. Okay. Let's see. Let's see what else we get in here. All right. Let's go. Come on. Come on, pal. Day evolve. I want to see a beautiful art rare in the back back here. That's all I want to see. Phalanx, giraffe, and a luxury. All right. Obsidian flames and uh, a Charizard. I mean, uh, hello, hello. Hit that like button down below for a Charizard if you don't mind here. And that's. Thank you so much, Water Energy. This opening can now begin here. Let's go through this pack. Let's just go. Let's just go. Come on. Let's just go. Kangaskhan, Whizcash, Nose Pass, Audino, Houndstone. They're on the EX. That's not a Charizard. Lost Origin has a chance at a Charizard there in the Galer or the uh, Trainer Guy. I saw Crown Zenith back there. Black Code Cart, Silver Border Sweat for a Giratina would really uh, would really just would put me in the right state of mind here. Okay, Or Beetle, Holographic. We got. Something in the trainer gallery. I hope it's that Pikachu. Show it to us. Glade V on the trainer gallery. Full art. It's a nice card. I do like this Glade V. That's a, it's a nice full art there. Good stuff out of Lost Origin. There are better trainer gallery cards, though, out of Lost Origin. That one's fine, though. Crown Zenith. I want to see gold. I want to see gold. Yes, I do. <laughs> And more specifically, the Arceus Gold card. It seems like it would be a really fun card to pull today. All right, V-Star Energy to the back we go. Is Oh, I thought we... Another Radiant Charya Bug. Okay. And a Zosh and Hollow. All right, that's funny. Okay. Thanks, Ando. Two Charya Bugs. Now our red pack. Sun and Moon Era is our red pack here. And we've got... We pulled a red pack, and I think we did worse than the green pack. Okay. Not a fan. I don't like that. Sun and Moon Era, this is implying that you're going to get a better value than the green pack, and we did not. And we did not. Um, yeah, that's 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 not good. I don't like that. You know I will be as truthful as I can with these reviews, right? That's why we do this. But holy cow. We got a red pack and we went backwards. Um, okay. Palisand there in the back. So, third pack here. We got a green. We got a red. Silver. We got to get a silver or gold here. Come on, baby. Let's go. What do we got? What do we got? I want to see... Oh, for the love. If these packs are the same, we got, we're going to have some problems, unfortunately, I think. So, all right. Here we go. Empty. There's the mystery thing again. Same exact QR code. Lost Origin, Crown Zenith. No. No. Nope. Um, honestly, y'all, these are a do not buy. These are these are a do not buy. If uh, if that's how the red packs are going to potentially be as well, it is in incredibly difficult to get any sort of value back out of these. The red packs should be like Cosmic Eclipse or something like that. Or a really nice set there from, from Sun and Moon. Like, it's... um. Yeah, Scarlet and Violet, same. We get, okay, I do have more of these for future videos, just so y'all are aware. But the fact that we got the same five packs in the same order in three in a row makes me think that all of them are going to have the same five packs in them, and it's not a mystery pack. It's not a mystery pack at that point. Just sell this. I, I, it's, uh, yeah, no, I, I, I'm sorry. I, I, these are uh, these are a do not buy, unfortunately. We got something in the, we got an art rare at least. Riolu, not a bad one to get out of Scarlet and Violet base. They're the Klefki. We'll take the Riolu. 
Very, very cool stuff here. I love this Riolu. The whole line of Riolu looks awesome. Cool. Beautiful card there. Pal Dave off. Show me an art rare, baby. Keep this art rare trainer rolling. Let's level up our art rares here to a magic card, shall we? Come on. Come on, Pal Dave. Water energy. Let's go. Oh, okay. Water energy. Not in this one. Jet energy. Practice studio in Tinkerton. Okay, that would be a nice art rare to get. Obsidian flames. Okay. Okay, here we go. One to the front here. Okay. One to the front. Lightning energy. Charizard. Charizard. We might have one in the very back. That very well could be a Charizard. Carvana, show it to us. Tyranitar. EX. Oh, boy. Lost Origin Giratina artwork here. If this green pack is also Crown Zenith, we have legitimately pulled better on our green packs than we did our red pack. That's like... <laughs> I, I am not a fan of that in any way, shape, or form. Chorus in a Politoed. Crown Zenith here. Gold? A gold card would look super nice. Back to our $10 worth of pools back there thus far today. Water energy. Okay. Lightning energy. I'll never be able to call it. We we got a double banger. Zabazenta V-Star. Let's go through this pack. Let's have some fun with it, right? Switch. Pancham. Helioptile. Wulu. Whoop. Come on. Scrub. Roxanne on the floor, trainer. All right, nice trainer. Uh, could not have been cut worse if you had a blindfold on, unfortunately. Uh, the left is real thick there. Nice Roxanne, full art trainer. Roxanne. Very, very nice stuff. All right, green pack here. Evolving Skies, Crown Zenith, something fun. Here we go. Okay. No. It's just, it, it is, it is frustrating. It really is. When the red pack is a sun and moon base pack. What is that? Three or $4? I mean, not, not a collectible set really by anybody at this point. And we get two crowns either out of our green packs. I mean, that's, that should not be a thing. Tangela in Lycanroc. Let me know your thoughts on Andos. I'm going to leave mystery packs down below. I do want to know what you think of these. It helps me shape how I do mystery pack videos in the future and all that. I don't mind doing them because it supports YouTubers, y'all. It's super critical to support YouTube. I'm not saying that as a YouTuber, but support YouTubers that you enjoy watching, y'all. That is super critical. To the back we go here. Roxanne Riolu. Don't support this to the point where you get ripped off, though, right? I want to make that as the, the side note here. And the Gallade V back there. Uh, nice, nice stuff from three packs. As you would expect, only 15 packs opened up, or 18 packs opened up today. And uh, with nine of them being uh, scored about early, I mean, we I think we did okay. We kind of we kind of did okay based on what we opened up today. But that will do it for today's video. Again, y'all, let me know what you think of these packs down below. Do not forget, go watch Saturday's video. Not this video. This video is not the entry video. Saturday's video is the official entry video to get entered to win this beautiful slab here. Check this video right here. This is the official entry video, and hope to see you guys in the next video.